Hi everyone, Arlen here. Welcome back to my Country Craft Corner. And I'm sitting outside on my patio again today and it is about 100 degrees out here. <laughs> but I'm not gonna be out here very long, but I did, I didn't think I was gonna come back again this week, you guys, but I've gotten a lot done this morning. I stripped the bed my dad's gonna sleep in and we went grocery shopping and I've done some dusting and so I'm in good shape. I just need to, you know, vacuum and we need to do the hardwood floors and finish dusting and spiff up the bathrooms, you know, and that type of thing. <laughs> and I need to do my fruit salad and my strawberry shortcake tomorrow. So this probably will be the last time that I see you guys this week, really and truly this time. I, I'm, I'm not messing with you. I well, wasn't yesterday either, but but my Clinique order came. So I wanted to do this haul, this Clinique haul. I'm excited to show this to you. They always pack things up so nice, honest to goodness, they do. So I wanted to show you. I did spend a total of $95.82. And that was with free shipping and handling. So I bought all merchandise, uh, but I got everything I did get a couple of things that I have never gotten before and I wanted to try, but they were having a special that you could, I got like how many free things here? Let me see if I can figure this out. A, a moisture team, which is two items, I believe. Then I got a free gift, even better clinical dark spot corrector. Got a little dark spot over here, a little age spot that I'm going to try it on. We'll see. And then a seven-piece online bonus sunset chick. So I will go through all of those little bonus items that I got. And a really pretty uh, case, too. Before I go, look how it's packaged. It has a little Clinique sticker on it. They gave you, it was a full-size container for the free, uh, the free gift was full-size. So here it is, even better clinical dark spot corrector. Everything looks so pretty. And their signature green box. All right, so there was that. So that was free. And then I got a couple of chubby sticks. Lips, uh, let's see, I got one for my eye. This is lip balm. And the color is Mega Melon. Look, that's a pretty color. Hopefully, I, I tell you, I never stray away from my raspberry color, but that's really pretty. And I love how this goes on and how it, it just is so smooth and nice. So hopefully, I like that color. So that again is Mega Melon Chubby Stick Lip Balm. Let's see. Then I got moisturizing lip color balm and this one is super strawberry so let's see what this looks like y'all see my cheeks getting red it is hot out here <laughs> but it's still really pretty oh that's pretty look at that love that Oh, that's going to be pretty. All right. So there's my two lipsticks. Then I got Chubby Stick Eyeshadow. So I've never tried. This is the thing I've never tried. So I thought I would try this. And this color is Lots of Latte. I do usually wear browns mostly browns and tans about this color. I really took a guess on this one. You know, it's hard to tell online. But I think that'll be perfect. I love it. Ooh, that's pretty. Look at that. Lots of latte. And I got another one, another chubby stick for eyes. And this one is called 
pink and plenty. Ooh, it's kind of a peachy color. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Wow. Ooh, that's pretty. Love them. Love those colors. I'm excited. Get to try something new. All right. And let's see what else did I get. Let me see how. Let me tell you how much those cost. The chubby stick. They were all seventeen dollars. All the chubby sticks, whether they're eye for the eyes or for the lips, they were all seventeen dollars. Okay. Now, let's see. I got a blush. So I needed a new blush. And this is Blushing uh, Smoldering Plum. Ooh, that's pretty. There we go. That's pretty. Comes with a compact. With a mirror. Smoldering Plum. So nice and pretty. Got that. And that was $23. And the rest of this were my free gifts. Here's my bag. I'll go through that in a minute. And then I got, I had to pick these two. And this is the uh, moisture tea. Girl can always use more moisture at my age. <laughs> Let me tell you. Okay, so this is Moisture Surge Extended Thirst Relief. I believe these are both for the eyes. All about eyes. Reduces circles, puffs, and something that I can't read because it's not my language. I guess it just reduces circles and puffy eyes. I sometimes, I don't get too many circles, but I do get, you know, sometimes I get a little puffy underneath. Not too bad though, but you know, sometimes. So I could sure use it. And I think I will put the moisture relief under my, you know, around my eyes, underneath my my daily cream that I, my lotion. I use lotion, heavy duty lotion on my face every morning. And then after I cleanse in the evening, I, I put, uh, I think it's dramatically different moisturizing lotion on my face. It's in the, it's yellow if you go on to Clinique.com. Anyway, let's go through this spiffy bag and see what surprises I have awaiting me in here. I had to pick a color scheme, so it was either between like violets and then desert or something like that. I think I picked the violets, I can't remember. Let's, we'll check it out though. Really cute case. It's really summery. Very nicely made. It's yellow on the inside. Okay, let's see. Here's the inside story on all the goodies in your gift. Okay, take the day off makeup remover for lids, lashes, and lips. Okay. Take the day off. There it is. And next, dramatically different. This is what I use every day. So this is perfect. This is perfect for me to take on my trips. Dramatically different moisturizing lotion. And a little, I usually get a big pump bottle. So this is perfect for my cruises and stuff. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Let's see, Pep Start Eye Cream. It's all about the eyes, you know? <laughs> Let's see, there it is. Pep Smart Eye, eye Cream. A pep rush for eyes. Just three seconds to look wide awake, refreshed. Hydrates, brightens, perks you up. <laughs> it's, it's cool touch and depuffing tip help keep eyes looking fresh. Smooths the way for makeup too. Then let's see, all about shadow quad. I thought this was a great deal and a free gift to get four eyeshadows from Clinique. You know, you can't really beat this. And I, yep, I did. I picked the, the purples. Check it out. 
Aren't they pretty? Whoops, I have them in there. There we go. Their eyeshadow was so nice too. I usually use CoverGirl, but, and I had never tried the Clinique, but I did try it finally just recently, like within the last six months, and just, I really like it. I still do use my CoverGirl because I bought a bunch of them. They were on sale like about a year ago, and I bought like five of them just so I could, you know, get the good sale. I'm so cheap. I buy good stuff, but I look for sales and use coupons all the time, girls. You know, you got to save money where you can, but sometimes you don't want to, you know, unless you absolutely have to compromise, you know. So anyway, the High Impact Mascara. Let's see. This is what I use every day. And again, this is good to take on trips, although I usually just go ahead and, and take my uh, my regular size mascara. But this is nice to keep in my purse, in my little cosmetic bag in my purse. So, and this is what I use every day. So I was thrilled to see this in the, in the little gift. And then Clinique Pop Lip Color prim and Primer. Rouge Intense. Plum Pop. It's called Plum Pop. Just a little, look, it's just a little lipstick. How cute is that? <laughs> oh. That's pretty. That is one. I'm ran out of hand here. Oh, that's gonna be so pretty, you guys. Let me see. Can I, like, blot my lips here? Put some of this on. I don't know whether you guys can see or not. I can't see myself. It's so bright out here. <laughs> Hang on. Ooh, it's pretty sheer. That's pretty. That's really pretty for summer. So that's it. That was all I got. I got a lot free. And you know, Clinique's not cheap, you guys, unfortunately. But it is really good, and I have used it for years and years and years and years and years and have never had any trouble with my skin. I don't break out. Well, of course, I used to you know, but I don't break out much anymore. Sometimes I'll get a pimple, you know, now and again, but not too often. And like I say, I'm, I feel like I've been pretty blessed with pretty good skin. Thanks mom. <laughs> she had beautiful skin. Oh my goodness. My mama had the prettiest skin. Oh. So hopefully some of that rubbed off on me. <laughs> I see Stacy is texting me. I don't know what she's texting about, but it keeps popping up on my phone here. <laughs> I just love that girl so much. I'll tell you. She's awesome. All right. I'm taking everything out of the boxes and putting them in my bag here. Everything's going to fit in my bag. <laughs> I got it all in my little case here, and I will take it in to my bathroom and distribute it there and in my purse and wherever else I think I will use it so. well I think that will do it for today <laughs> I'm really glad I was able to come back on find some time to come back on and say hey and share this little haul with you guys and oh by the way I did want to tell you this I did tell you guys about Sam right did I tell you guys about Sam yes I did in a car chit chat, I think I did tell you about Sam. How he was having troubles, and he would just sit up, and he looked so painful and sore and everything. And he had had a Lyme test, which was negative, but we took him back in for his year. And this was a couple months ago. We took him back in for his yearly yesterday, and I was really concerned because he, he does he gets better, and then he gets worse, and then he gets better. So had him tested for Lyme again. Of course, it's they're, they're regular blood tests, you know, Lyme and heartworm and all of that stuff. And I heard from the vet and she said, he's negative, negative for heartworm, negative for Lyme. And, you know, so he's in good shape. Thank goodness. So it, it seems he's six and a half, but for a new fee, six and a half is getting into senior citizen territory, believe it or not, because he's a giant breed. So... We are going to be starting him on some anti-inflammatories, which we hate to do, but we also don't like because, you know, they can affect the kidney and liver and that kind of thing. But 
we are going to put him on it just at low dose just to help keep the inflammation away which will in turn help him and then we have another mild medication called gabapentin maybe some of you have heard that for that you might use it for human use but they also have it for canines and it's a very mild you know uh, pain reliever so we got him some of that too to help him cope each day and we're hoping that you know with time he'll get a little better he's already on uh, you know joint supplement and dasiquin he's already on dasiquin we always take really good care of our pups and make sure that they have the very best quality of life and uh, so but I was really thrilled that he he got a clean bill of health you guys <laughs> which is fantastic oh. Whoa. Also, Chris has groomed him and we took his coat down to about an inch and a half all the way around. I'll show y'all a picture. Probably not here because he, Chris isn't quite done. <laughs> uh, but uh, we'll get some pictures up of him next week. I'm sure I'll be taking some of him this weekend. So anyway, that's the story about Sam and my clinic call. And now I really am melting. I'm just melting out here. So I am going to close this down for today and say until next time, probably next week, y'all take good care. Bye-bye.